Welcome back to the course Learn Blockchain. Today we will be learning about Orphan Block. We introduced Orphan Block in section 1 when we talk about second challenge of consensus protocol, the competing chain. There we understood that when two or more blocks are mined by the miners at the same time, we encounter an issue which block should be added. And the solution was the longest chain win, where they wait for a couple of more blocks to be added. For the moment there will be multiple chain and the chain who first adds another block to the chain wins according to the longest chain principle and all the other nodes replaced with that longest chain. Then we also see that the blocks of the losing chain, the conflicting blocks are called orphan block. So in this video, we will look what happens to those orphan block. First of all, if you see here, there are some of the orphan block which are not part of the main chain. You can see the details of the orphan block, transaction hash, timestamp, number of transaction in that block, fee and the one who mined that block. Now let's see what happened to those orphan block. When the block become orphan, all the transactions in that block are released back to the mempool of the miner of that block. And if some of the transactions among them are already been added by the another miner in other block, they are removed from the mempool and you know what happens next. How miners pick transaction, so this release transaction will be added to some other block. In the case if those transactions are not picked by any miner till certain period of time like 72 cent per hour, they are released back to the one who issues it. As mempool keeps the transaction up to certain time only, if the transaction do not get added to any block during this time, they are released back to the one who performed that transaction. So if you see here, we encounter a problem that is called double spend problem. So what double spend problem is, for example if you bought a bicycle using bitcoin and transaction occurs successfully, so you got the bicycle. After some time what happens is, there occur conflict. Multiple blocks are mined at the same time, there is issue which block should be added. Let's assume the chain with the block in which your transaction lies loses and it become orphan. So the transaction are released back to the mempool of that miner. And again let's say your transaction of buying bicycle does not get selected by any miners so after some time it get released back to you. So the transaction never happens means you get your bitcoin back but still you have that bicycle. This is double spend problem. So in order to reduce this problem, there are some mechanisms like waiting for 5 or 6 confirmation like that. You should have noticed this. When you perform any transaction, the amount do not get transferred after one confirmation. It waits for more confirmation like 6 or 7. So that there is less chance of double spend. Even if the block with the transaction get released back, there won't be double spend. So this is what happens to the orphan block. It is one of the phenomenon of the blockchain. It happens sometime. So I hope you have understood all about the orphan block now and on this note, I will see you in the next video.